It's a beat that spans thousands of kilometres covering towns like Tennant Creek and Alice Springs and currently it's all under the control of acting Southern Commander Kirsten Engels. Alice Springs has its own unique issues. To address those issues, NT Police recently launched Operation Thayer to meet what they termed a crime spike. It's given us a chance to redirect our resources to, uh, to meet that spike. Um, it's been going really well. Uh, it's started to reduce the numbers that we've had of property offending. Acting Commander Engels says the operation was bolstered mostly by local cops returning from COVID duties. We did have some assistance from Darwin-based members uh, who have since returned back to Darwin. So what impact did COVID have on the force? We had around about 60 officers redeployed to COVID. We had cops that one moment they were at home, the next minute they're out in the middle of absolutely nowhere for days or weeks on end. Um, protecting the people of the Northern Territory. During the pandemic it was said that you know obviously there was a lot of police that were being tied up. Um, now the police are back in town, we've got more boots on the ground, is it helping address crime? I think any more numbers on the ground is absolutely helpful. But the top cop admits there's only so much the men and women in blue can do to break the crime cycle. This is not a policing matter as such to, to break those cycles. We respond when a crime's happened, we attempt to engage in, and prevent a crime from, from occurring. However, to really get to the crux of the issue, we need those multi-agencies, whole of government to stand up. A key issue for residents of the desert city, safety on the streets. Would you personally walk down the street in Alice Springs as a civilian late at night? Look, I think uh, any place that I go late at night, you have to take some preventative measures. That's an unpopular message, but it's one that we like to put out to the public. Are Red Centre residents fed up with crime? I think they are. I think the community as a whole are fed up with crime. That's why we'll continue to hit it. We'll continue to turn up 24-7. We'll continue to make the arrests. We'll continue to put people in front of the courts. And we'll continue to ask the other agencies to work with us. It must be very tiring going through this. What's morale like out on the beach? Oh, well, we, uh, we're quite a young station. We've got quite a lot of uh, new recruits here, um, mixed in with those who have been here quite a long time. Look, do we get frustrated? Absolutely. We'll keep, we'll keep doing this. We, we're not going to give up. We're, we're as energetic as we, we ever were, and we're just going to keep uh, building on our strategies, building on our resources, and um, hitting crime where we need to. In Alice Springs, Jack Hahn, Nine News.